Ephesians 1 and 3. Blessed be the power and the Father, our Lord Yahweh Shah Mashiach, who have blessed us in all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in the Mashiach. We give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and Son, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah Bahashem, Waharakakudash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. GMS of Arkansas come with a short list. Ephesians 1 and 3, blessed be the power in our Father of our Lord Yahweh Shai, who have blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in the Mashiach. Okay, so this is why we continue to give all praise and honor and glory to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Because through Yahweh Shai, his Father has given us all these, uh, uh, what's going to be eternal blessings, man. Okay, through him. Okay, and it's only given to certain men. It's not given to all men. Okay, let me show you verse four. According as he has chosen us in him before the foundation of the world, that he should be holy and without blame before him in love, that he has chosen. Okay, eclectomai, eclect. Am I to pick out, to choose, to pick or choose out of oneself, choosing one out, out of many. See, choosing one out of many. Okay. Solomon said in the seventh chapter, out of a thousand men, he only found one righteous man. Okay. So this is not for everybody, man. Okay. Only a chosen few. Many are called, but few are chosen. Yahweh Shah choosing his disciples. Choosing one is for his office of God's chosen whom he judged fit to receive his favors and separate from the rest of mankind to be peculiar his own and to be attended continually by his gracious oversight, i.e. the Israelites. See, so out of the Israelites, the Most High have chosen special men, peculiar men to his own self. Okay. That's why we are certain men are hated, okay, for this gospel. And we come in the stead of Yahweh Shah. They hated him. He said, if they hated me, they're going to hate you. And we're finding that out. We're going through the sufferings, man. We're suffering along with him, man. Patiently suffering, okay. Going through hardships, man, and afflictions, okay. It says, having predestinated us unto the adoption of children by Yahweh Shai Mashiach to himself, according to the good pleasure of his will. Okay? His desires, man. His desire is for us to walk and try to be perfect as he was, man. Okay? And to preach this gospel to the ends of the earth. Okay? That's his, that's his will, good will, his desires for us, man. Okay, he predestinated, meaning what? Pro itzo, to predetermine, to decide beforehand. See, to ordain or decide beforehand. Okay, having predestinated beforehand, he decided us unto the adoption of children, the adoption of children. See, the adoptions as sons. The relationship which the Most High was pleased to establish between himself and the Israelites in preference to all other nations. Okay. See, a natural and condition of the true disciples of Amashiach, who by receiving the spirit of the Most High Yahweh into their souls became sons of God. There it is, man. So this thing is about the elect, man. Okay, it's all about the elect. That's why you have a lot of people, they don't understand what the scriptures is talking about because it's, it's not dealing with them. It's only dealing with, he only dealing with the elect men. Okay, and the elect men are the men who are going to be right there with him, who are going to praise him, they're going to teach his word and push his gospel. Okay, uh, let's get this. John 17. John 17 and 9 
He says, I pray for them. I pray not for the world, but for them which thou hast given me, for they are thine. See, thou hast given me, they are thine. Meaning, we're, we're basically friends with Yahweh Shai. Okay, he was the friends of the disciples. And I say that because you look at the word thine, it's Zeus. See, you go down to Strong's, thine own, thy friend. Okay, so we are friends of Yahweh Shai. The elect men are friends, his friends. He said, pray for them. Okay, he prayed for them. Autos, himself, themselves, the same. The same. Okay. His own, their, themselves. But he said, I pray not for the world. But people have you believe John 3, 16. They said, for God so loved the world. What world was that talking about? It's a 2889, which is a cosmos, which is an orderly arrangement. And he said, I pray not for the world, even though the Lord said, I don't even pray for the whole world of Israel. He's talking about Israel. He's only dealing with the elect because they were predestinated to do his will and his desires before they even came here. So he's not even praying for the whole nation at this particular time when he was there. He praying, he praying for those Israelites, man, those elect. Okay, but all Israel will be saved pursuing the Romans 11 chapter. But the Lord was dealing with the elect, man. Okay, it says, and all, and all are mine, and all are thine, and they are mine, and I am glorified in them. Okay, he's glorified in us, man. That's why we, we, we're walking this walk, we're preaching this gospel. We're going through the afflictions that he suffered. We're going through the hardships. Okay. We we are standing together in one like mind, the brothers, for one common goal. That's to just to push the word, that the word get out there, that the elect be wakened, and that, that the Yahweh Shai soon come and give us what the eternal glory. Okay. It says, and now I am no more in the world. But these are in the world, meaning the elect men will steer here, pushing and fighting. You know, it says, and I come to thee, meaning what? By death, he came back to the heavenly father. Okay. Holy father, keep through thy own name, Yahweh, those whom thou hast given me, that they keep that name. That's how we know the name Yahweh Basha and Yahweh Shai. And that name sounds foreign to the heathen. It's dreadful. That name is dreadful among the heathen pursuing the Malachi, uh, the first chapter. And it says that they may be one as we are of the same mind. Okay. Walking in the same stead, speaking the same things. Like I said, uh, uh, being, standing together, suffering together, that we may get this eternal glory together. Okay. So with that, I hope this short lesson was edifying to the elect of Israel. Call la yim la Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Wahara Kakwadash, and double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect GMS Arkansas. To the next time, say Shalom.